What's up, everybody? It's your boy Will Games215 underscore in the building, and today we are here with Tower of God. Uh, episode what episode is this? Episode 97, chapter 514. Um, last chapter, Yama and Doom were fighting against Yastracha, and um, it seems like he really wasn't like worried, like. Like before, when he first fought against him, he was scared and had fear. And now it's like he's not scared. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, I'm sorry. Not cool. Bit. But now he's not scared and he's ready to fight to avenge his father, Yama. And um, Hadoom wants him to like come with a plan. But Doom's like, no, I just want all the smoke. So we're going to see what's going to happen with that fight. Also, Rock, Dom. And well, Rock and Kun have got power ups, but we don't know what power up Bam has. But I'm pretty sure he has a power up because it's Bam. Like, why wouldn't he have a power up at this point? Like, he gets power ups like like that. But um, without further ado, we're gonna jump on into this reaction. But before we do, do not forget to like, comment, subscribe, follow, share, all of those good things. Uh, let's dive on into the reaction. Yo, huff, huff. Damn it. I qu can't quench my thirst. That's right. Um, White. He lost his power and something emerged from him. And I think someone mentioned in the comments that they feel like Bam might have broken the curse that was on him to quell his thirst, maybe. So I would not be surprised if somehow, some way he becomes... Look at these grays, bro. Look, I'm getting gray hairs. I wouldn't be surprised if somehow, some way he becomes like an ally to Bam because like he has that power for some reason. Like, no matter how much I drink, huff, huff. Hey, you over there, are you okay? Step, step. Are you, I'm saying you are Hoquin? Vincent, why are you here? I was meditating. Reading, reading, whilst, reading while listening to the waves helps me settle my mind. I see, then I'll leave you to it. Step. You do have a nice hobby. A noble hobby, I'm sorry. Hoquin, yes. Since we met like this outside, how about a small talk? Dot, dot, dot. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Ah, sitting down helps a little. <sighs> it's always beautiful. Of course, it's one of Father's swords. A sword that never that never stained with any blood even after cutting someone that sword is the goal of every swordsman in the Ari family are you always on edge because you have such a high goal what are you trying to pick a fight with me you're the strongest in your age group but you always seem to fret so basically Vincent is like I don't know why you're always stressed out like you're the strongest in your group like why so tense all the time? It's probably because he wants to live up to daddy's expectations. Whether he says he doesn't want to, we every anime villain always wants to live up to mommy or daddy's idea of them. That's like the recipe to make a villain. Or if they don't want to live up to them, they want to be better than them. Like Vincent, you on the other hand don't look so ambitious, even though you're talented. That's not true. I'm ambitious too. It just doesn't show because I always control my mind. You really talk like an old man. <laughs> I feel thirst. Thirst? Right. Thirst for power. I get stronger as I gain more power, but my thirst gets stronger too. It's natural to desire for more power as you get stronger. But my fear is getting stronger too. Fear? Yeah. I feel like I'm taking a different role than the one father took, says Hoquin. I don't think he was greedy like me when he was building up his power. So if I keep getting stronger like this, I feel like I'll never get a hold of this power. Like fa like fathers that I desire so much. What did I say? What did I say? <laughs> the waves crashing against that sword sound as if they keep criticizing me. So I keep running and straying away. Hoquin, you're not the only one. I feel the same. And he grabs him. Huh? All our brothers have the same pain as you. 
I also ran away from Father's sword. That's why I'm reading this book. To use the spell written in this book and gr possess greater power. Let's do it together. It was me who raised a soul-eating monster inside me. But I wasn't the only one who mastered. You. The spell to use that monster. No. Perhaps he mastered it before me. Swoosh. Swish. Huh? His hair has gotten shorter. Thank you. You made White escape to his inner self. Are you the other self of White Turtle? White escaped to his inner self. That means you're a turtle with multiple personalities. Uh, duh. Did you not? <laughs> when they were on the hell train, there was a girl, White, well, a girl, Hoquin, a little Hoquin, and I think there was like a, that one, the one that Bam absorbed, and then there was another one. So this is clearly another part of his soul. I guess you can say that. White hid inside. I see you wake up. I'm sorry, I see you every time I wake up, dinosaur. Looks like it was a big shock for him to lose to that boy. I took that chance to come out. Oh, whatever. So, are you our enemy or not? Well, what do you think? He ran away. That punk. Tower of God. The one high above. Swoosh. Huh? Bing, swoosh. Essencio. I'm sorry. Essence. Oh, my God. Essencio. Essenio. I don't know how to say this dude's name. Kun's brother. <laughs> Did you really catch that mouse to come out? No, I couldn't. I knew it. I caught a normal one. Earlier, the cat tower. All right. Time to catch a mouse. What? what? Wait. Just give me a minute. I have something to say. I don't like dragging things out. I'll just catch you now and get out of here. You moron. Do you think you can go out to the battlefield by catching me? You moron. You're dead meat. N no. I take that back. A genius. Genius. Wow. How very clever of you to try and go out to the field by catching me. But sorry. I'm a player. So catching me out. Me get you out of here. <laughs> I guess. I can I can use my hearing ability to find a mouse fast. So, I'll let I'll tell you where it is. Huh, yeah, but would I really trust you that much? Trust me, I've got hard feelings against Yarshasha too. And from a species I'm from a species that he destroyed. I follow him out of fear, but I'm not loyal enough to sacrifice my life for him. The vision commanders of our army corp are nothing but trophies to, oh, really, of Yarstrach's conquest. We don't have trust or loyalty to our army corp, commander like the other army corps do. I joined the corp only because I was terrified by Yarstrach's transformation. Please trust me. I'll find you a mouse. If you let me go, I'll tell you everything you want to know. Everything I want to know? Okay, I'll let you go. Whoa, really? One condition. God, don't tell anyone what happened in here. And from here on out, you can't attack anyone or go out to the field. If you do, I'll find you no matter what, and I'll kill you. I'll tear those big ears and tail off. The Kun family hates to be stabbed in the back. Up, oh, yes, because we know from Kun. <laughs> uh. And you have to tell me everything I ask for, okay? Uh, okay, okay, I promise. That's how I got out. <laughs> but is that white? He seems to become smaller. Is he one of the Kun family? And his hair is shorter. I think I can beat him easily. <laughs> oh my God, don't even try it. No, enough with fighting. Just like Hoquin, my ambition is directed at my father. But I have no grudge against you all. But there's still Hoquin inside you. Why do we have to miss the golden opportunity to get rid of that guy? It won't be easy for White to come out. I can control him while he's while his mind is weak now. 
Besides, don't all of you have no time to lose? Yeah, like we are here for someone. Your participant lost consciousness. And isn't that boy's master waiting beyond the wall? Plus, the game has only a few turns left. Wouldn't it, be, wouldn't it be not that favorable spending more time here because of me? Yeah, he's right. What's your call? I don't really care what happens. It's annoying, but he's right. The game has a time limit. It's an opportunity, but we must not forget the original objective of this battle. Besides, that guy looks pretty smart, too. I guess we don't have a choice. All right. We'll stop fighting here. That's a wise decision. Finish line. Who is this girl? Okay, so Bam's inside the... I forgot her freaking name. Oh my God, I'm so mad I forgot her name. Every time I see her, I want to say Rachel, but it's not Rachel. And Bam is inside the lighthouse. Why is everyone following us to the finish line? She is like, <laughs> my neck is still intact. They're following us so naturally. Hey, are you guys really coming along? Well, of course, for me. Now that I'm a traitor, I have no place to go. I have nowhere to go either. Damn it. How did we end up with such a ridiculous party? Hey, they strong. So, I mean, I will use them, good. But are you really not going to tell me what that request is? Well, to be honest, I don't know exactly. I don't know what exactly it is either. I would know after meeting the princess. Are you serious? Then let's go. Thump. Participant Bam has arrived at the finish line. Swoosh. Teleporting to the destination. Nest in front of the third wall. Great. You guys cleared the game faster than the other teams. Oh, what the hell? How did you get here? Huh? Harion. Wow, they really arrived. Good work, but don't I not see the don't I not see the most important person? He's inside my light, my lighthouse. He's unconscious right now. Sounds like you had a rough time again. But you even brought along these weirdos. That's a bit harsh. It's not like I wanted to either. True, true. Let's hurry. Before Jin Sung Ha gets locked up. In the suspendium. Whoosh. We need to go over that wall. Whoosh. Huge suspendium behind the third wall. Looks like the irregular cleared the game. He'll be here soon. Will that boy really meet my expectations? I'm curious. And then we have Jung Sung Ha. He says, don't come, bam. The one waiting in front of here is too high above you. This chapter was definitely longer than previous chapters. I feel like previous chapters were shorter. But other than that, this was a good chapter. It was a good chapter. We got a little bit of backstory on Ho Quinn, who has multiple personalities, apparently, it seems like. Um, which, I mean, kind of made sense if you really pay attention from back like the Hell Train. And the multiple things that he had, souls that he had to absorb. Why wouldn't you become, why wouldn't you get multiple personalities after that? It says, according to Dr. Wright, Rack, <laughs> White suffers from multiple turtle disorder. Uh, clearly. It says, Bam went through hell to get to that destination. And he, there's just, exactly, like, she's just chilling, like, the red turtle. Like, she's just chilling. Like, how did you get here? Like... <laughs> it says I have nowhere to go I betrayed her I also have nowhere to go Me either Why does it feel like that goes for all of Bam's allies It really like Bam decimates the whole enemy team And then their remains just join him Like it's hilarious Like They said it's really cool to see all these different characters in Iraq They have finally made it to their destination This is really hype Who knew Vincent and Asino would join them I mean, I figured that. I figured they would. like, And I know I'm not saying the names right. But their names are super high. Hard, I mean, it's a high. So, so everyone got powered up. They gained even more followers. And they still didn't even have to kill White. Yeah. 
he should have died. Bro. He should be gone. Like, I'm kind of sick of him at this point. Like, I don't know if he's a bad character or if I just feel like he's just been here for too long. Like, I don't know. Like, I don't know. <laughs> but that's going to do it for the reaction to uh, Tower of God. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of the chapter. What you think will happen next chapter? Um, I feel like we'll get some like revelation about Mashini. Um, definitely feel like she's pulling the strings. I don't know why she's giving me like end game arc boss. I don't know. Like <laughs> it's given what is given. Yeah, no. But um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, follow, share all those good things. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about Tower of God. And it's your boy Will Games two one five underscore signing out. And it's my guy.